What up everybody, so the Easter raid started uh, earlier today and it's now the first troop versus troop. Oh wait, I gotta pet the pet I think. Yep, do that. See if it'll get us in there, knowing there's probably a lot of people trying to get in. There we go. We've got 20 energy, so we're just gonna do our best. I believe it's a wind boss. But my rock team's not that great, and I'm just going to use my water team because it's got the two different swaps on it. And because it's turn-based. Well, I don't have any uh, three blue gems here, but we'll try and clear a good amount of the board. And we got no water gem drops, unfortunately. I think this is the last turn I get to take, so I'm going to do both the swaps. Yep. Decent amount of trophies after one hit.
Here we go. Another 9100 trophies. Yeah, we can accept those because there's no energy in them. Come on, just accept it. Thank you. Alright. We'll accept some other gifts too. Such as this. Come on. Finally. Accept that. Reward Ultra. That Super Egg. This. Another Super. What else? We got rogue feeders here. Another cavalry and a rogue. Some more cavalry feeders. So, um, yeah, might as well accept these for what I'm going to do. So now I got something to feed cavalries to. majority of this is panzers and crystals so those can stay all right now we're in our inventory is overloaded again but in the meantime before I forget let's do another fail of this I mean attempt oh it's not a fail that is awesome. That is also sweet because we only need one white rune per attempt this time. So I might not be at 79 for too long. That is really sweet. Oh, ooh, three reds, but I got 23 stacked up. So that's about, what, seven attempts? Probably eight by the time I can get eight. Uh, white runes anyways. Let's see how much uh, power rating we gain from that, though. Almost 2,000. Pretty sweet. That's my buddy telling me that there's probably a Dragonite in uh, my area for Pokemon Go. So I may pause the video and make a little run for it or something if it's close by. So we already did that one.
Ooh, that's a cavalry. That's good. Yep, it is a Dragonite. Uh, 89% IVs, pretty sweet. That's probably definitely worth going to get. And yes, I do still play Pokemon Go. I'm not too far off from level 36 in the game. Come on, just name it. Thank you. Probably don't need to be naming them if I'm just going to eat them anyways. Come on. And my internet's being laggy as hell. So I got a lot of cavalry feeders. Well, I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to run for that Dragonite. I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. I did catch it. It was uh, 2,629 CP. And, uh, pretty good. But anyways, our energy's almost regened up. So almost time to do another 5 energy hit on the TVT. Wait, I didn't look at this, but... Come on. Alrighty, so this is this was my first R Ultra team, of course. This is my second one, which is pretty much stronger than the first one. If I was to put the, all the equipment onto this team. Because it's still on my water team. Still haven't fixed them all. They're all still broke. This is what it is. So I don't really care. Just trying to get high power rating. Trying to get reach over 700,000. Which I didn't. Or whatever. And these are all the reward epic mobs I have all together. And my next project is to build an all reward epic fire team. Second Evolve. And this is my only base mob I have for the team so far. So this is what I've been feeding my cavalry feeders to. I already sent it to my other accounts and ate all the cavalries on it, but only got it to a four. So let's see if we can get it up a little bit more. Yeah, whatever. Only oh, yeah. have never we'll go with sixty three percent chance.
Oh, now I gotta go for a chancy? Jesus. But we got it to a five. Sweet. No R boost, though. No, not that. So unfortunately, I've only got these two left. So why not try and get a, another passive up at 20%. Well, we didn't get a passive up, but we did get uh, three points of our boost. So I'll, de I'll definitely take that, even though none of it's an attack, but any R boost on this will be welcomed. Now let's see if we can get some more R boost on this guy. Because I'm, what I'm hoping to be able to do is maybe trade this for a feeder for this guy or something. Because right now this isn't very valuable. This mob's an old mob, and not very many people want it, unless I can stack a bunch of Arbus on it. Sweet, got some more. I think that was all the supers I want to feed to this. video I think I said I was gonna give this away if I've reached 500 subscribers by the end of March that didn't happen so unfortunately he's not gonna be given away I'm just gonna eat it Ben Banaki is however giving away a good reward super I mean ultra if he gets 200 subscribers so if you guys want a good reward ultra go and subscribe to his channel and uh Gives yourself a chance to win it. I think he's just going to randomly pick uh, one of his subscribers or something. Or he's telling me to pick it or something. I don't know what he... I think i got to pick some a winner for something else. And I apologize for not getting back to any of the winners of the 10 war reward supers. I still have them. They'll stay in here. i got to find the time to go through the comments from the video. I still have all the email notifications of of the comments from the video, so I'll go through them according to however I received them. So first come first serve for the most part. I know a lot of people wanted like the cyber worm and the the Gorpion. And I think a few people also wanted the bumpy Barky. So I'm gonna go according to first come first serve then. We'll take care of that in a future video. Probably in the next few days, I'll hopefully get around to doing that for you guys. But now I'm gonna feed some terrible reward ultras that I'll never use to this. See if we can get a lot of our boost on this. Starting with this. Gets a 40% chance over the 10% chance. And I don't remember how many points it is, but it's definitely more than super points. Sweet, we got some. Nice. 
Got a decent amount there. We're up to 13 points on it. This guy's pretty much useless. It's been on BC rank for quite a while with no good offers, so feed it away. Nothing at all. And now my game is frozen. I eat the mob and the game freezes. Alright, now we're good. And these are also pretty much useless, so I'm just gonna eat these two. And nothing. Hopefully we can get some more of with this one. And nope. It's getting there. Decent amount. Oh, and this guy recently got a new second evolve. So hopefully they'll be released again with a different uh, active. Because Deadshot's it's powerful, but it has a seven turn active weight or whatever. So basically it doesn't, it's like a, super snipe but you gotta wait seven turns in order for it to activate and in an event like this where it's turn based you're gonna be able to use the active once so that time to hit again See, I can do good combos. All you haters that have commented on my previous videos. You suck at jamming, blah, blah, blah. I can get some good combos. I think I did some pretty good combos this during this video. Unfortunately, I don't get that many water drops.
Oh, well, we got a reward rare. So let's accept that and eat it. Oh, it's a cavalry. So, I'll be fed to this guy. I doubt it'll do anything. 10% chance at a passive level up and only 2.5% chance of R boost. I think R boost would be like, what, two points? There you go. Absolutely nothing. But oh well. But anyways, I'm gonna do my best to get these mobs traded out to build this team up. Could take a while because reward epics are a lot harder to trade than ultras and event mobs and everything. So I'll see what I can do. And once again, I apologize to all the people that are waiting on... Uh, the rewards for the questions that they've submitted in an old video. But I'll get to that as soon as I can. But I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And have a good one.